welcome to Stephen's Family Outdoors. This week's episode takes us to November 22nd, 2016. It's uh, gun season for bucks or does. So join us this week as we take a nice, well, just look at the video and see. Have a good day. You're watching Stephen's Family Outdoors. Hey folks, this is JW. Uh, just got out of my tree stand today and um, I heard a shout earlier and just happens to be that my grandson Johnny and um, Robert, Bobby Luke, are up here with his daddy up at the shooting house and Johnny shot him a doe. So we're going up here and, and catch the action here and see his... Uh, looks on his face whenever he uh, sees the camera and his pappy coming. He's my grandson and I'm really proud of him. So we're on our way up. Folks, he just, he just smoked himself a deer at eight years old. Here it is. Probably one excited little boy, I'm sure. His daddy texted me and said, Johnny said, make sure you don't tell Mama he wants to surprise Mama. He loves his Mama Stevens. He loves them all, but I'm sure. But he loves his Mama Stevens. She's not just a mama, she's his buddy. Look here. Look at down here. Okay, I heard a shot. What's going on? Hey, Happy wants to know what's going on here, little mister. What's going on here? It's a button buck. Tell me about it. We were, yeah. we were hunting at the house. It was in the uh, logs, and it, when I shot it, it jumped into the fence. It took off running, didn't it? Yeah. Wow. All right, look where you hit it. Look where you hit it at. Wow, look where you got it. Right in the heart and lungs. I Ooh. thought I got it right there. Good shot, buddy. Right in the heart and lungs. Hey. Yes, sir. And who are you? John B. Stevens. Johnny Stevens. Shoot the back, one of the back of the big dog. 
far back, yep. Hold on. Nice shot. Alright, now I'm going to show you how to properly field dress uh, your white tail. First of all, you want to talk, if it's a female, you want to start off with the uh, mammaries here. And if it was a male, you want to start off with the, uh, the testicles. Uh, you want to cut around them like such. She was milk. <laughs> 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 Well, makes two this evening. Me and my, uh, ugh, me and my uh, younger brother Tommy actually out here on our farm up and uh, decided to put uh, put some wham bam on two uh, two adult does up here. Very blessed, very thankful. Looking forward to a prosperous year. We're on a pretty two big adult does. Just thin out the herd a little bit. They're uh, they're pretty heavy up here this time of year, so. Thank you, Lord. I'm Samuel Stevens. Well, I tell you, man. Good job, brother. Yeah, man. Hunting up here. Tonight was one of those nights we came in knowing there's going to be uh, early action. Got in a little bit, a uh, little bit earlier than we usually do. Right off the bat, started seeing deer movement. It's uh, November 22nd, 2016. Uh, week of Thanksgiving. Got myself this monster doe at about 150 yards, dropped her right in her tracks. Old 308 put a smack down on that girl. Old 308 put a smack down on her, and I got this here doe after uh, Tommy took a shot at uh, took the shot and dropped his gal. This one came up to kind of investigate the situation, gave me an opportunity to take a shot. We're looking forward to getting these back and getting them uh, getting them field dressed and tagging them, tagging them up and. Uh, Getting some of this meat out to people who could use it. I'm pro staffer Tommy Stevens. And I'm pro staffer Sam. Have a good night. Good job, brother. I got her. I'm on her. To your right, take her right there.
doe up there. So, gotta get rid of some of these does on this farm. So we're waiting on a buck. We can shoot a doe and a buck the same day here in West Virginia. mistake on my part I had a big deal out in front of me camera on it perfect everything except I forgot the most important part to hit record I dropped her in the tracks perfect video shot if it would have been on camera oh well love to fight another day guys JW with Stephen's Family Outdoors again and uh, we were doing a little deer push today on doe season and this nice doe stepped out and uh, stood for me and uh, we thank the Lord that we're able to uh, harvest her clean and humanely and we thank him for that and you're watching Stephen's Family Outdoors. Have a good day and God bless. Hey guys, uh, today I'm going to show you, tonight should I say, I'm going to show you how to properly field dress a white-tailed deer. Uh, first thing you want to do is if it's a female, you want to come down here, you want to cut around the mammaries. If it's a male, it be the other, other parts. Come right here, just cut around them. You want to get those taken off first. These all taken care of. off, split this, here, that, here, and be careful, you just want to use the tip of your knife because you don't want to puncture the stomach because you have guts everywhere, you don't want that. Follow it all the way up, you hit the brisket, and then when you hit the brisket, you want to Bring it up along the side of her. You don't want to go straight up the middle. Come up right here. Let me cut her all open good. See right there, she's split. Open parts are okay. Right. Step on that back leg. Take a step on that back leg. Be very careful because and you want to use a very sharp knife. Get all up in here. Get this all cut out. Cut out the liner. 
Round that. That's everything. Up in here, cut. Esophagus. Turn up. Ooh. That's how you properly field dress a white tail deer.